Right with Liberty Me, I'm Kyle Platt here with Lawrence Reed from the Foundation for Economic Education. Larry, it's a pleasure to see you. My pleasure, Kyle. Thank you. So, Freedom Fest is generally considered, or, or um, investment is a big part of it, and there's there's a certain age level here generally, but there's a lot more young people here. And um, the Foundation for Economic Education offers a lot of resources for younger libertarians. Can you talk a little bit about that? Absolutely. The Foundation for Economic Education is devoted to uh, the age group 16 to 24, uh, educating, inspiring, and then connecting young people to ideas of liberty and those who are out in the field practicing and promoting them. And uh, we have a very vibrant website at fee.org and uh, many programs during the summer for students and many things going on around the country and beyond uh, during the course of the year. Right. Is now the most hopeful time there's ever been for freedom? I know that sounds like a silly, maybe cliche question, but I mean, look at what's happening with the foundation, your foundation for economic education, uh, and our partnership uh, with Liberty.me, and all of these organizations that offer so many tools for young libertarians in college and fresh out of college. I mean, is, really, is now the most hopeful time we've had in a long time? Oh, very definitely, and I've been in this movement uh, since my teen years, which go back to the uh, 1960s, so I have seen more excitement uh, about ideas of liberty and where they can take us than I've uh, seen in my lifetime. Uh, partly because uh, you know, the current occupant of the White House has brought us to the brink in some ways, and people are looking for an alternative. Uh, we've tried the other side, and it's been found wanting, so um, liberty is exciting, uplifting, and people are turning on to it. Definitely. Definitely. If you could theme a slot machine or casino game after one prominent or famous thinker in the libertarian tradition, who would it be? Oh, I guess it would have to be Leonard Reed, uh, because he was our founder in 1946 uh, when he started Fee in Irvington, New York. Leonard, uh, to this day, I think, is much appreciated, but still underappreciated. But he was a great thinker and an inspiring man who brought many people to ideas of liberty. Unbelievably, that's the second time we've gotten that answer. Oh, really? That's fantastic. So everyone, everyone needs to uh, read Leonard Reed, uh, check out the Foundation for Economic Education. Uh, their publication, The Freeman, is fantastic. Of course, edited by Max Borders. And uh, thanks so much for talking. Let's, let's do it again soon. My pleasure. Thanks, uh, Carl, for all that you do, and Jeff Tucker and the others at uh, Liberty Me. All right. Thank you so much. Uh, from Freedom Fest 2014, thanks for watching.